A truck linked to a woman's death found on fire just five miles from where her body was found. Thanks for joining us. I'm Tony Lopez. And I'm Adrienne Moore. CBS 13's Marissa Perlman is live in Stockton tonight with how this piece of evidence could help move the investigation forward. Well, guys, now tonight, surveillance video and witnesses. That's what the Stockton Police Department will be searching for heading into the rest of this evening as they comb through the neighborhood today. Now, police are hoping evidence that they find on scene will lead them to a killer. Oh, yeah, truck's on fire. Hey, welcome to Stockton, right? A glow from flames and smoke caught on a surveillance camera outside of this neighbor's house. This black Sierra truck ditched and torched. So that looks like one caught on fire right then. There it is right there. See the smoke. Neighbors here heard the massive explosion as they were leaving for work. I didn't see. I just saw the flames kind of. And how high? Like pretty high? Super sky high. I started hearing, hearing uh, a bunch of like back like booming, like something blew up. You know, the gunshots or what, but it didn't sound like gunshots. Police had been searching Stockton for this truck for days after it was stolen from Mary Seller's house Friday. The 57 year old was found inside. She'd been brutally attacked and killed. Police believe her killer took the truck, drove it just five miles away, and set it on fire. As you can imagine, this vehicle is, was severely damaged. It was on fire, and the fire department did put a lot of water on this vehicle, so obviously it's going to be a little difficult trying to find evidence, but still, we're going to have to do the best job that we can. Yeah, now police and Crime Stoppers are offering a $10,000 reward for any information that could lead them to an arrest. They're hoping to get this person off the streets as soon as possible. Now, the biggest challenge for law enforcement in this case, they don't have a motive for who could do this to this victim, Mary Sellers. Guys? Yeah, pretty puzzling. Okay, Marissa, thanks. Hopefully, we'll get an update.